I'm David Purdom, and welcome to this edition of E-180. Tonight, the story of an internet mogul who decided to walk away at the pinnacle of his success and try an entirely new and different career path. But what makes this story so unusual is that it isn't just any mogul, and this isn't just any career path. The mogul is Bill Gates, who stepped down last week as chairman of Microsoft, a corporation that's been described as the most powerful, most successful, and to some, the most ruthless in the world. The new career? Mixed martial arts fighter. And you may have noticed that we've chosen to call our new show E-180. You could say that Bill Gates deciding to become an ultimate fighting championship fighter is the ultimate 180. It's my nature to seek new challenges, said Mr. Gates, whose first bout is scheduled for August 12th in Las Vegas in the women's lightweight division against rising MMA phenom Carrie Scar. Mr. Gates' lawyer has applied to Ultimate Fighting's governing board for a waiver of the rabbit punch and pile driver fouls, contending that those moves are, and I quote, an inseparable part of Bill's competitive technique. UFC President Dana White said his organization would sincerely consider the waiver. Waiver or no, Gates' opponent, Kerry Scar, is apparently unimpressed. Said Miss Scar at a joint press conference announcing the bout, he don't scare me none. We all put our Brazilian fighting bottoms on the same way, one leg at a time. Flashing his legendary wit, Gates quickly responded, Hasta la vista, and producing a chorus of guffaws from the press. I was there. So what chance does the inexperienced Mr. Gates have against one of the top-ranked female lightweights in the world? He's going to surprise people, said UFC's White. He's a mean little SOB. Just ask the folks at Netscape. Good luck to you, Mr. Gates. And good luck to you, Miss Scar. May the best fighter win. We'll be watching. This is David Purdom for E180 on E True Sports Television. We hope you'll join us next time. Good night for now. Thank you.